Yes, so the vernissage uh, Nightmares and Dreams came into being. Um, in January this year, I started to begin the production of my new album, Free Spirit. At the same time, I started the process of painting pictures because I wanted to accompany the whole musical uh, process with a visual art form, which I always did since my childhood. I was a painter, and one of my greatest inspirations, even in the childhood, was Salvador Dali. Salvador Dali had a special method by which he gained inspiration for his paintings and what he, what he did was he was sleeping on the couch and he got a, a silver spoon in his hand and I, always when he just fell asleep the silver spoon fell on a plate and the sound of it made him wake up so the image he captured in that moment at the subconscious mind he brought onto his drawings. So what I did was I took his method, changed it up a little bit. What I was doing was I put the cigar in my mouth, I let it burn, I smoked the cigar, I fall asleep and always when the ashes start to fall on my uh, muscular chest, I was waking up by the, by the burning and the image. I painted those images which came into my mind while doing the album. So what emerged at the end was like a, like a hero's journey, a classical hero's journey from darkness to light, which is also a representation of the cover of my album, Free Spirit. Beginning with the dark and slowly moving forward through struggles and fights into the brightness. When I was 13, I started to copy some Salvador Dali paintings, just as an homage I gained a whole lot of inspiration from Salvador Dali and this adds to the surrealistic touch of the paintings you see today at the Vernissage. So at the end all those paintings which emerged during the last six months but also historical paintings from our childhood and youth. We took them together and we made a nice coffee table book, put them all together so everybody can appreciate them at home. And uh, we combined this with printing the lyrics of all those songs which accompany the paintings, this hero's journey, uh, into one book. So it is a good thing if you take the book and you sit in front of your chimney and read it. And you can also dive into nightmares or dreams.